ba munisco na ba far de ces biko na fanya effort yote juu ya kusekirize population population wao wenyewe wana témoigne kama akokuwa munisco pale corona zani population awange ishi pale hata ku barabara ya bule akse kutoka bubu blue kwa mpaka kufika katoto na munisco na far de ces wanaungana yanafanya patrui usiku na mchana hapa ndani ya chef lié ya chefri sisi vile tuko nyuma yao sisi vile tunabaongoza kieti de yango ya lazima kama munisco anatoka gouvernement President Museveni has accused the United Nations of conserving terrorism in the Democratic Republic of Congo and bleeding churches in multiple countries in the Sahel region. Part of the terrorism in Africa is either created or conserved by some of the actors that try to be global policemen. The chores in Libya and the surrounding countries of the Sahel, Mali, Burkina Faso, Niger, Nigeria, Chad, ETC was caused by some of these actors. Terrorism conservation project in Eastern Congo for the past 20 years is by the UN which is controlled by some of these actors though the undemocratic structures of that body such as the Security Council he said in a statement issued on his ex on his Twitter handle yesterday. He added, it is amazing how the UN can supervise and coexist with killers of Congolese and Ugandans in Eastern Congo for the last 20 years, and they are not bothered at all. They have created free space for all sorts of empty-headed pigs to gather, train, steal resources of Congo, kill Congolese, and once in a while, kill Ugandans, as well as determining the economic future of the people of the Great Lakes. Mr. Amseveni said he will now consolidate efforts with the Congolese government to weed out the allied democratic forces terrorists accused of multiple attacks in both countries. Efforts to get a comment on the matter from the United Nations were futile by press time yesterday. When contacted, Mrs. Susan Namondo, the UN resident coordinator, declined the, to comment on the matter, saying she had not seen the statement and was traveling. The UN, under the United Nations Organization Stabilization Mission in the DRC, MONUSCO, has been in the DRC since 2010. MONUSCO replaced the United Nations Organization mi Mission in DRC. There were slightly more than 17,000 MONUSCO personnel deployed in the DRC as of February. The mission is, according to their website, authorized to use all necessary means to carry out its mandate relating to, among others, protection of civilians, humanitarian personnel and human rights defenders under imminent threat of physical violence and to support the DRC government in its stabilization and peace consolidation efforts. This is not the first time the president came after the United Nations for failing to pacify the Eastern Congo. In his 2018 State of Nation address, Mr. Museveni said, rule of best terrorism and 20 banditry was totally defeated and we built military and intelligence capacity to ensure that Uganda will never be threatened by terrorists operating from the rural areas. He added, the terrorists of ADF are still in Congo, preserved there by the UN and the Congo government. If, however, they were to enter Uganda, they would be promptly and decisively defeated. The ADF is one of the more than 100 armed groups operating in the DRC. According to the UN, it was designated a terrorist organization by the United States in March 2021. Kampala has accused the group of multiple attacks in the country, including the murder of two foreign tourists and their drive in Queen Elizabeth National Park last month. The July Lubiliha attack that left 40 people dead, as well as multiple bombings in the capital last year. 
Museven, in his statement, also congratulated the Uganda Police Defense Forces for averting planned attacks during the Nyege Nyege Music Festival held in Jinja last weekend.